Hey everyone, it's your friend Big Noodles, and welcome back to Roblox, where today we are playing the Bee Swarm Simulator Ant update once again. Guys, this update is amazing. If you think that this is amazing, click the like button. I think it is the best update yet. Although, there is one thing that I just noticed that I don't like about the update. So, I'm gonna start and be really super critical about this update because I don't like it. No, really all it is, there is a cosmetic change. It seems that maybe this is gonna be changed back. But if you guys remember, when you have legendary bees in your hive, there used to be little particles coming out of them. Like, kind of like you see on my diamond bees right here. But now, with the numbers, when this was introduced, it's gone. You see, nobody has any of those effects and I kind of miss it. It's about the only thing I don't like about this update. Everything else is awesome. Well done. So uh, we've only got the one gifted bee, the lonely guy on the corner there, but we need more. Um, and I think what I'm gonna do is, you guys asked for it in the last video. You guys wanted me to buy the Super Summer Star Pack for 3,500 Robux. There you go. Uh, whatever, request, oh, a million. It could be a million honey. A million honey! Okay. <laughs> Your request was granted. Oh, now that's interesting. I can actually buy all of them. If you want me to buy the Summer Star Pack and the Summer Treat Pack in the next episode, because I thought I could only buy one of them, click the like button, guys. If we get enough likes, I will buy the other two and just waste all my Robux on this game. <laughs> all right, so we do have 1,100 tickets. 29 ant passes. We have a star treat and who are we going to give the star treat to which turns a bee into a gifted bee? Ooh, you know, all right, we're gonna go with this one. We're gonna give it to the photon bee, one of the best bees in my opinion in the game. Here we go, gifted photon bee! Yeah, all right, let's see. So, uh, let's see, let's see what we get out of that. What is the gifted power of the photon bee? Gifted hive bonus plus 5% instant conversion. Doesn't sound like a lot, but it actually is when you are, con well, when you're collecting pollen, we will get a 5% boost, which is, I mean, w w let's see what we'd have to get right now for instant conversion. Yeah, I don't even see any badges that give us uh, increased instant conversion. Now I have increased conversion on an instant. <sighs> we got some royal jelly, but I, I, I always hate using it. Well, Let's see what kind of bees we've got here. Let's see, well, we'll use it on one bee that we're not too terribly fond of. Uh, let's get down here. So I, I don't really care a lot for shy bees. Um, so we can go and get one of those or use it on one of those, but, but we need some more royal jelly. So let's go, where do we buy it? Where is it? How much is this? What is it? What do I pay? For? Can I just buy star power? <gasps> Ooh, I got another star tree. Oh, and I got a thousand tickets. I gotta buy it. I gotta buy it. So basically that summer pack that I bought you get two star treats out of it So two gifted bees. Oh wait, did it give it to me? Oh, it did receive star treat. Okay, great. Oh What's that? Dude, what did I just get? What's that star? What is this? It's a uh, inspire Two. what was that? Times two pollen. I've never seen that boost before the star Is that is that one of my gifted powers? Maybe I don't I don't know what that was. I've never seen that token before. Whoa! The, my, so my diamond bee uh, level five does twenty-two thousand when it collects pollen. That's crazy. Because before this update, I think it was around the seven thousand, so three times the speed. Wow! That makes such a difference. All right. So I am going to actually give this star treat to this diamond bee. This is my most powerful diamond bee, and I know I should give it to my event bees, but I'm gonna go ahead and see what this does. So, let's see what we get out of that with a gifted diamond bee. Gifted diamond bee. Plus 10% blue pollen, woo! That is good, and it's, it gives it to the hive, right? To all of my bees, not just itself. That's huge. So wait, if I were to get one, so if I were to get like, well, let's see, how many diamond bees do I have? Well, four, five, six. So I would get a 60% boost. Holy cow, those star pieces are super valuable, guys. Oh, hey, check this out, I didn't even see this before. A star egg. 
Ooh, limit five per player, ha! Huh? Okay, and um, they're expensive. But for now, let's just not, let's not think about that. Let's not think about that. Let's just go ahead and buy some royal jelly. See if we can, um, See if we can convert one of our bees into a gifted bee. Let's see if we get lucky. We'll try it with 10 on one of my shy bees. Because uh one of the one of the uh one of the quests is to use a royal jelly. So we'll do that. Oh, and we're oh, I need to buy some more treats. So I'm gonna just do one and then go and see her because I feel like she's gonna ask me to do more quests. Oh, there's a ticket on top. Uh she's gonna nope, no, 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 no. She's gonna ask me to do more quests with the royal jelly. Alright, so let's give treats uh we're gonna give them to gifted bees, actually. Let's give, let's give ten. There we go. All ten. Oh man, it didn't even get it to level five. Really? Ugh. Okay. Uh, and then so we did that, and we just needed royal jelly. Is that? Oh, dude, I needed fifteen. Okay. And then we're gonna use a royal jelly. I said on a shy bee, right? Didn't that, isn't that what I said? So, let's choose one of the. T I have so many shy bees. I don't know why. Uh, so let's use a royal jelly, and this is probably gonna make it non-legendary on a shy bee here. Yep. A bomber bee. Ooh! Now that is cool. Look at this. This use another. Okay, wait, wait. Nope, 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 nope. You're not gonna make me do that. Nope, nope. I gotta go and finish my quest because she's gonna ask me to use a bunch more. Exciting, isn't it? You never know when your bee will transform into it when you give it a royal jelly, but keep in mind, you might not always like the result. Come talk to me again when you're ready for another lesson on raising bees. Okay, let me talk about my personal favorite treat. Strawberries. They're not only delicious and sweet, they're also healthy and raise your bond with a bee by 25. Strawberries can be found in the strawberry field. I know many types of bees love strawberry. Rascal, rad, rage. Oh, oh. Rascal, rad, rage, Riley, baby, and shy bee. All of strawberries more than any other treat. Ooh, I'm gonna have to start keeping track of this. When you feed one to them, they gain twice as much bond. And even have a tiny chance of becoming gifted for this lesson. I want you to feed 20 treats and five strawberries to your bees. In addition, raise one bee to level five and five bees to level four. Oh, so it had nothing to do with the, uh, with, uh, okay, so we've got that. We need 20 treats. Dude. This is gonna get so expensive. Three, four, five. Oh, she gave me some. Woof, 20. Good thing I didn't just keep going. All right, I'm glad I checked that. Okay, so now all we gotta do is get some strawberries. She didn't give us any, did she? I don't think she did, no. But that's really cool knowing that certain ones like it more than others and then we can possibly get them gifted. That would be amazing. Um, because then I don't have to use the royal jellies. <laughs> I, I can just let my uh, I can just let my bees or I can just use the treats and I don't know But I don't know what the chance is, you know, I wonder if it's you have a better chance of getting a um, If you have a better chance of getting a gifted bee through using royal jelly than you do with giving them Strawberries and blueberries and pineapples and stuff All right now that my bees are leveled up a little better. Let's see how much better they attack the werewolf. It's level six so, yeah, I'm still getting a lot of misses, but more hits than I was before. Yeah, that's way better. Okay, all right, yeah. And look, we got uh, Music B up to level four. Oh, I would assume that maybe any of the level three ones are the ones missing and the rest are hitting? I don't know. Okay, 20 treats are going to this guy. Bear B, enjoy. Did you get to level five? Yeah! Woo! -hoo! All right, cool. Uh, then, um, we need to give strawberries, and we want to give them to bees that like them. What did it, I mean, let's go down. So, I, I didn't say anything about crimson. Shy bee, it said, but I, I don't really care much for my shy bee. Demon. Baby bee. Uh, gives me luck. Gifted bonus is, oh, you can see the gifted bonus without actually getting it. Is that, is that, oh, I didn't even notice. Shocked. Okay. So, plus 10% red pollen would be good though, huh? That'd be really good. That makes my, my shy bees a little more valuable if they get gifted. So let's, let's try this. Shy, let's just give it all to, no, let's, let's not. Okay, so, yeah, look, it went up by 50. Beautiful. All right, let's do that. Let's do it all then. Did it go up? No, it didn't even go up. Okay, but we've got we finished this quest and our backpack is already empty. The strawberries around here are always ripe and delicious. In fact, the whole mountain is rich and full of life. I attribute that 
to all the wonderful bees and their caring beekeepers like you. Remember, try to feed your strawberries to a bee really appreciates them. Rascal Rad Rage Rattle Baby Shy got twice as much bond out of strawberries. Come talk to me again when you're ready for another lesson. Okie dokie. You don't give, you know, you don't give out much honey. Blueberries are a little harder to find, but they grow in more places. If you're lucky, maybe you find them in the blue flower place. Rhino beetles may also drop them. Blueberries are definitely worth the hassle, though. They're the favorite treat of, ah, there we go, diamond. <laughs> That's what we're talking about. It's all I can, it's all I need to hear, Mother Bear. For this lesson, raise three bees a level of fun. Feed 10 blueberries and 30 trees to your bees. Okay, how many treats did you give me? Five, so I've got to buy 25 treats. I wish there was a way to buy them more quickly. All right, so I noticed something, and it might be just a coincidence, but it seems like the, at least the, in the blueberries case, and I don't really remember the strawberries, but it seems like the blueberries are only, like they only show up near to the flowers. And, and a lot of times behind the flowers themselves, not just these ones, but that one over there. And that one, it might be a coincidence or a fluke, but it's something I've noticed that like if I'm, if I'm in the middle of the field here, I don't seem to get any blueberries, but if I'm near flowers, I do. Yeah, see right next to the flower. I'm serious. Like it, it, they're not, they never form away from flowers. So, uh, I mean, it might, again, might be a coincidence, but just a tip, stay near the flowers because it can't hurt. <laughs> just try and stay near them and you might get more. You might not, but uh, be better off if there is even a slight chance just to take that, uh, to take the advice. All right, so uh, we got to feed 30 treats and 10 blueberries to my bees. Now, uh, I'm going to go with another diamond bee just to boost my blue. Uh, so let's see. Um, wait, what, can I see? Oh, I can. You just click on the bee. Aha, 478 out of 100. If I give 10 bees, it's gonna put it at 978 or 10 blueberries, I believe. 10. Then we just need to do one and two. What? Oh, no. <laughs> I can't do math. <laughs> Three. We need to get a 1008. Hey, there we go. Beautiful. Now, I didn't get gifted, even though I gave 10 blueberries and then they said that I might. Um, who else needs to level up? Um, I wonder, so, so these bees, 469, so the treats, well, I'll just give it all to the tabby. There you go. Um, oh, look, Diamond Bee loves blueberry. Yeah, I know, it does. Okay, cool. So, I think we've done this quest. Yeah, okay, cool. Now, we need to do, we need to do an ant quest, and there is something else you guys have been telling about, some secret bear tunnel or something. So, we're gonna go look at that in a second. But, yes, uh, let's see what she has to say now. Have you ever heard of gifted bees? They're very rare and incredibly useful. They look similar to ordinary bees, but they've got beautiful star patterns on them. They also have unique colors that make them stand out. They collect 50% more pollen and make honey 50%. I did not know that. They do that too in addition to their, their what? Most importantly, they offer hive bonuses that enhance the power of your entire swarm. For example, gifted cool bee includes all the blue pollen you receive by 10%. That's a big deal. You can receive gifted bees when hatching or transforming bees. A bee also has a small chance to become gifted if you feed it its favorite treat. There are even special eggs and items guarantee. We'll talk about those later. Here's your next lesson. Feed 50 treats. Raise one bee to level six, five bees to level five, and use three royal. I knew you were going to do the royal jelly thing. That's why I saved them. All right, so let's go Let's go fight some ants because that is another thing. And then we have to fight some tunnel bear or something, which I think we're probably going to lose, but we'll see. Oh, dude, Black Bear gives out. Yo, keep doing these requests. These, he gave out 10 pineapples. Dude, do the repetitive quests. I haven't, I haven't seen him in a while, but dude, he actually, does it tell me? Oh, it doesn't tell me what he's going to give me, but he gives it. He gave me pineapples. That's beautiful. Did not expect that. So you said if I fire the red cannon, I should be able to see the tunnel. Oh, yeah, I see the tunnel. I see. Okay, we have to drop down this thing here. Okay, there's a hole here to drop down. Oh, wait, this is a lot easier. Hold on. Here we go. Whoop. And we're in. Okay, now what? I don't know what's happening here. Is there a secret? <gasps> there's a secret wall, guys. Whoa. What what is what what's that bee winking at us for? Okay. Oh, holy! Hi. Okay, that guy just killed me. The tunnel bear just killed me in like one second. Let's try that again. Go bees, go fight! 
Why are you not fighting? There you go. There you go. Miss, miss, miss. And then can I go like this? Whoop. Yeah. Oh, nope. He <laughs> one shots, dude. Okay, so my bees are a little underpowered. So I think the goal or the, the, the strategy there is to uh, upgrade your bees. That's the only way that's happening. We'll fight the tunnel bear in another episode if you guys want to see that. All right, here we go. Now we've got some powerful ants. Well, no, we've got some powerful bees here, uh, and hopefully they can take out these ants. Oh yeah, this will be good. This will be good. Look at that! Boom! Oh my goodness! So that's a thing. So <laughs> that's one thing that's bad about having all these special abilities is you can get a lot of ants on the map in a lot of. Well, I guess you kind of want that though, don't you? You do want a lot of ants on the map at once because the more ants you get, ugh. I missed it. No, I didn't. What? Oh, they're too busy fighting to actually collect anything. Okay, come on. Kill some ants. Kill that ant with the hat or whatever that was. Okay, there we go. Get this. Oh, that didn't even- there was nothing there! Come on, kill the ants. Kill the ants. Kill the ants. I'm trying my best here. Get them! There you go. Give me some stuff. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, we got flies. Okay, those are some of the ones we have to collect or kill for the quest, I think. Yo, doing all right. Look at my bees doing work, baby. Yes. Oh, yeah. Give me that. Give me that. Give me that. Yeah, that's right. There we go. We're gonna have some dropping in a minute. Oh, we got a giant ant. That's one of the ones we needed. Okay. Oh, my goodness. Now we've got the farting fire ants who poop. Oh, jeez. Who poop? Fire! No, 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 no. Watch out. Watch out. Watch out. Oh, jeez. Did I get stuck on the wall again? No, no, no. Okay. I feel like they're not... Okay, The definitely the giant ant is attacking. No! No, no. That was terrible. What did I... So keep old. Yeah, definitely. Look at this is look at that. Why would I even think about that? Okay. Uh what 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 did what did I did I get anything? Okay, got 15 10 flying ants. Woof. That's tough. Jeez. All right. So, let's um let's try one more time for that tunnel bear. Oh no, 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 no. We're not going to be able, You know what? Oh, you know what we should do? Hold on. No tunnel bear. We're going to try for the uh the the, the king beetle. The king beetle. You guys remember it is stuck right back here. Let's wait for my bees to arrive. I made a mistake last time. Um, and let's see if he's any harder. All right, they're here. Here we go. Let's go, guys. Uh, okay, he looks the same. Is he going to stop? There he goes. He's stopping and out of the way. Here we go. Man, I feel like they're not even hitting him very much. Okay. Oh, my goodness. It's all misses. Oh, dude, this is going to take ages he's level seven i mean i could probably do it because i've got this glider which makes an epic difference in avoiding him um let's see if we can do it let's see if we can do it he is level seven so it is not going to be too easy um or it's just going to take a long long time all right he hasn't even hit me once it's not hard to avoid him but i think that he actually regens at almost the same rate that I'm taking off damage because I've been going for five minutes and he's lost about 10% health. So extrapolating that, it's gonna take about 45 to 50 minutes to beat him, um, which is boring. <laughs> Song name, what? Um, so we're just gonna head out here. Wait, he might hit me now. Nope, never got me. Never got me, not even once. Uh, but yeah, basically I need to level up my bees so that they can actually hit him. Oh, I got a blueberry. Nice, he dropped one, that's sweet. Um, because right now it's just gonna take way too long. He is easy now that I've got the glider and the hat, like the beekeeper's mask. It is way easy to beat him, but there's just there's really nothing. Like it, it, there's just really no chance when none of your bees hit him. He actually has a little bit of regen, and probably the same goes for the tunnel bear. So we're gonna have to level him up, maybe off camera, so that in the next episode we can beat at least the king beetle, maybe the tunnel bear. If you guys are looking forward to that. Go ahead and pick up those chopsticks and poke that like button as hard as you can. And please do become a noodler today and subscribe. And don't forget to tap the bell. I'll see you guys again soon. Thanks for watching. And of course, we live.